Hey guys, I wanted to give you some fun facts about news of the day political commentary that you may not know. Number one, news of the day is exactly what it is. It is news of the day. So you do not have an opportunity to prep for the interview. So for example, if you own a clothing store and I wanted to interview you on your clothing store, you would know what you want to talk about. You know your clothing store, you know the product, and you know your narrative and you have an opportunity to control your narrative. Well, news of the day commentary doesn't work like that. It is exactly what we what it is. Is, which is news of the day that could be something literally breaking in my ear I've had a uh, whole switch topics literally while I've been on the set um, typically I get my topics as I'm heading to the studio if you're lucky you'll get it the day before uh, but typically you're just getting the topic uh, you are not getting any questions in advance as well so the host can ask you anything at any time they can go in any direction so either you know it or you don't and it is really really important that you know your position and your principles because that is what's going to guide you through your commentary. So a lot of people don't know that. And I wanted to share that with you. Another thing that people don't know is you really only have about 20 to 30 seconds to respond. If you look at most people's commentary, it may be from two minutes to five minutes, sometimes even less than that. You may be on a panel with someone else or it is it is at least you and the host. So if you look at two minutes and you break that time down, you'll notice that you really only have 20 to 30 seconds to respond to a question. And what that entails is actually answering the question and responding back whatever your counter argument is or whatever it is that you're trying to make your point. That is very challenging for for people to do. You'll notice with the Democrat candidates, a lot of them struggle with being able to give 30 second responses. In fact, many of them said, oh, you know, it's so tough to answer that question in 30 seconds. Uh, Joe Biden is one. He has said that, uh, you know, he doesn't like the quick responses, but news of the day commentators do that all the time. You got to be able to do that if you're going to be on live national TV. Another thing that people don't know is I am looking at a wall. Uh, there are some commentators that uh, get what you call the return fee that allows you to see the host in front of you, but it's always a delay. But at the studio I go to, we do not have a return fee. So I'm literally looking at a wall. So it's kind of like I live my life uh, with faith. You know how we say we uh, that we walk in faith, not by sight. Well, that is literally uh, how I am doing my political commentary. So I have to listen um, to what the host is saying uh, to give me an opportunity to jump in to know when there's that awkward pause that, you know, kind of gives me a chance to get my my comment in. And so that's all audio because I can't see her. Um, and so that is challenging for people to do. So that's why you may see some of those awkward pauses sometimes when people are giving commentary because they may not uh, be seeing the host. And even if there are, even if they are uh, looking at the host, there's always a delay. Uh, so you have to be really skilled at not only listening um, to what they're saying, but also thinking at the same time, what am I going to say while they're answering? And, uh, asking the question. That is a challenge uh, for people to do as well. Um, so those are just a couple things I wanted to share with you uh, just because I was sharing it with someone else and I said, you know, I don't know if people really know what news of the day commentary is. There's a big difference uh, than just, you know, interviewing for something that you're familiar with. And it is exactly the reason why I do not argue with people anymore on social media like I used to, uh, because anybody can type out a response. Uh, but the, the real test is, can you verbally articulate uh, your message and can you verbally uh, debate and go back and forth and can you do it within 20 or 30 seconds? So arguing on Facebook, going back and forth, long extended uh, dissertations. Uh, I'm not into that these days. Uh, if you want to see if you can hang with me and get in the ring with me, then let's do it verbally and I'll be happy to take on your challenge. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm not taking on your challenge. You, you're welcome to debate and talk to the wall. Uh, like I tell people all the time, my position is my position. I'm just one opinion. And like I always say, use it, lose it. Can't make you choose it. Teslonfirgo.com, y'all. Take care. I'm a motherfucking Yeah, I'm talking murder, but it's me. But it's me. I'm really living everything you see. What you say? They a lot to make a lie out of me. To the day that I expire, I'm a G. I'm a motherfucking G. They would love to make a lie out of Razor. Shoot and catch him out dark with the lane.